Hello and welcome back to another episode of Europa Universalis 4 as we continue our game with Divet. In the previous episode we went to war against Ayutthaya and we took Prenokor and Nun. So we are now flipping the culture in Prenokor. Nun is actually still coring but we will get there soon enough. We also uh, switched our uh, monarch. Our monarch died so our heir got to be in charge and our current air is terrific look at that 246 that's a wonderful wonderful air i would like this one to be uh, to be in our um well in charge of our country for a long time so we'll try and make uh, our ruler die soon uh, our army is in the process the process of being uh, reinforced still we still have a very very little manpower don't worry, that will change soon. Our legitimacy is improving, so that is good as well. Uh, these guys, 175, well, we can actually start to improve relations with them. If I had any kind of diplomats, which I don't. A lot of discovery sp spreads. Alright, so apparently we are now watching Muscovy, the Ottomans. Oh, the Ottomans are, are already in uh, the Arabian Peninsula and um, well mammals still exist Yemen actually got all the way up to up here oh interesting all right and we got we see Muscovy Siberia is still going strong uh, Muscovy will will inherit well will form Russia maybe they are at war with a lot of people target of the coalition of Sweden Lithuania Crimea and Siberia well they are at war with them and Great Britain is in the war as well so let's put it to the treasury we need the money to improve our uh, infrastructure so let's see what we can do uh, constables uh, 1.0 all right there are a couple of 1.0s over here temples 1.05 all right so i guess we are going for the temple first so let's get um well it was this one correct yep so let's get the temple there and then we'll build the constable there which will improve the temple the bonuses are uh, stack up they stack up the bonuses from the temple constable and uh, there are a couple of others namely the town hall and the treasury treasury is very very good this uh, the line of production I'm really fond of it tax modifier plus 50% and then plus 5 that's terrific I find it really really good all right now i only want these guys to leave the freaking coalition against us that could be terrific if they would we need a border with pegu though we need to declare war upon them let me see they are allied with majapahit or at or really they are still oh god damn it or at or you sl you god damn it you are al you allied everyone every single one didn't you level 10 already in techno in military technology huh how about that level 10 in military technology how about it they are still cannot nomad god damn it level 10 that is crazy how the heck all right zoo declare war upon ming so what that order will probably join in Uzbek, yep, no, Zu and Pegu. Orator did not answer the call to arms, uh, but they are still allied. Dang it. Alright, well, we, Nan is now a core province. Let's flip the culture of that province as well. This is still being done. Now we can. Zu left the coalition. Terrific. Now, Ayutthaya. Coalition against Ivet. Who is in the coalition against me? Ayutthaya alone. Terrific. Ayutthaya, do I have the claim already? No. So let's wait. I'm going to wait. I'm going to keep this guy there. Just in case. And is this already a zoo province? Yes, it is. Now, I want this up as fast as possible, though. And we have no manpower whatsoever, so that is uh, tricky. 
Uh, armories or temples or constable 1.20 let's build a constable first want more money we are only making 2.10 it's not too good let's actually drop this all the way down what the hell this way this will re will uh, will uh, regen so that is good I thought they have no alliances whatsoever I only want the this done which is almost so let's boost again our maintenance back to the top we are losing a bit of money apparently come on conquest terrific let's diplomacy declare war no diplomats there we go take Ayutthaya and I'll declare war no need to call for uh, allies because Ayutthaya is alone change the culture of none that was quick Let's uh Vientian 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 Where is Vientian? Nope. Let's find it. Vientian. Right in front of my nose. They have two manpower nineteen. Huh. Well let's gain base tax. We need money, don't we? We need money. Uh, let's use caution. Bohemia in the religious turmoil. Really, we. Yep, we. Whoa! What the heck happened to France? All uh, right, that is kind of scary. That is kind of scary. All right, all right. So is moving along sooner or later we'll be able to get that siege done and we are reinforcing already terrific regenerating our manpower there terrific terrific let's support it still support it all support it all the way and almost there to get the main technology and there we go a hundred percent let's uh, do full annexation uh, cannot do anything else let's do this and there we go air falls ill oh gosh oh we lived alright getting worried there for a second but he lived uh, let's score it it will cost a lot but we need to core it nonetheless uh, force limits military technology huh 3330 30. let's get military technology this will save up a bit by the way do we have um, nope we don't and in here we do but it's a level 3 so never mind now we are collecting that is good news at least at least we have that we are collecting we need to make uh, Patani our uh, let's uh, our rival. So let's put Patani. Patani as our rival right there. And the way we will bypass the alliance that Zu or Pegu have with um, Orat Ord is I'm going to declare war for against Patani. Make them. Uh, Pegu, Shukotai, Patani is a core. Uh, make them. And these guys are Sunni. Oh, bummer. We need to declare war soon upon these guys. Otherwise, we'll be really, really hard-pressed in converting these provinces. So let's start fabricating claims. I was saying, I'm going to uh, call them to arms uh, against these guys. And s before I make peace with Patani, I'll actually... Uh, get declare war upon Pegu so that will require at least two wars and Zu is going at it really really oof that's scary peasants war oh no oh god damn it 
The peasantry has for some time demanded economic, religious and political amendments. Their dissatisfaction has grown to such an extent that violent revolts are becoming a common day practice. Even though there is no central leadership and they lack proper armament, the peasants have still managed to pose a challenge to the authority. Several, several important buildings, both religious and other, have been burned and plundered as a protest. Dark times are ahead of us. Six stability and... God dang it. 134. Oh, for crying out loud. I'm going to be at minus three stability for a while. The revolts are going to be crazy though, and we are going to be... <laughs> God damn it. Oh, peasants war. Oh, 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 oh. That's not good. I didn't prepare for this. I did not prepare for this. Uh, could handle them. Our treatment. Uh, let's see the revolt risk. Who? God damn it! Ten percent at least everywhere. Who? 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 Flip this culture, will you? Soon. Right. Let's. Let's see what we can do. I only want this one to core. Well, actually. <sighs> 134. Oh, we need to boost it. Alright. All the way to zero. And this way we'll hopefully have less of a revolt risk. Yes, terrific. Oh, for crying out loud. Uh, uh, god dang it. Alright, hunt rebels. And I need to boost my maintenance all the way to the top. Prenocore has flipped the, the culture, that's good news. Bear relations over time. Uh, wait, wait. Alright, now you can go. Uh, sure, let's take loans, what the hell. Let's take a few more loans. Oh, bummer. Need to put stability back to three. So we can uh, end the time of troubles. It's the time of troubles that we have, correct? In increase innovative. Peasants war. No, the peasants war. Alright. And of course I thought I revolted. God dang it. Come on. Really? And our trader died. Lovely. And oh, god damn it! Mila, anything else really? For crying out loud! Thank you. Two point twenty nine. Oh, for. Uh, ah, yeah, yeah. All right, this is not good, not good, not good, not good. Will you core it? Will you just core? December. Seam rip. Huh. Lose ducats, lose prestige, and the event, the end of the peasants' war. Hmm. Let's do this one. We'll take a few a few more loans, but God dang it. Really? Re 
Restore order. Taken loans. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take, take, and take. Right, we have a lot of loans to repay, and we are losing money, which is lovely. Oh. Now, let's drop this. Like so, you guys move there. Mon Patriots. Mon. Mon. This is Sunni already and this is Buddhist still. And that effectively dropped our freaking... Oh, God, I hate that event so much. We are really... We would... We were really, really close to to taking the Noble Republic idea and then BAM! All the way down! There we go! That's fun, isn't it? <sighs> Better relations over time, sure. Ah, dang it. Let's improve relations over here. really do hate that event. Uh, let's improve it here as well. So you can integrate these guys and have a border with Pegu. At least we'll have that. At the very least we'll have that. Alright, Poland. Religious Civil Disorder. Have fun. Whoa, Ming is really... Damn. Ming is done for. No, no, no. Repay, repay, repay. Repay loans. We have tons of it. 65. Oof. What's our interest? 1.74. Oh, God. That's a lot. Uh, nobility cannot be bought. Let's... Oh, 300. Huh, lovely. Repay, repay one. There. This way the interest already dropped quite a bit. Do I not have... Nope. They have a claim here already. Didn't I put yet? Yeah. Pegu. Nope, I didn't. Pegu Shokutai. Nope. Six point zero eight. Alright. Three hundred. Really? Ugh. Sixty-three, so now we are going to be able to repay one more. Eight freaking loans. Ah, oh, four crying out loud. Ugh. Now we are without an heir. Personal union with Orat Ord. Oh, lovely. Just get me a freaking air, will you? <laughs> Can anything else happen in this playthrough? Oh, God. Ugh. Can anything else happen in this freaking playthrough? Friends here is scaring the heck out of me. Conquest against Pegu. Lost the conquest against Patani. Oh, Pegu already is here. Oh, God. But, oh, we forgot to claim here. 
these guys are Buddhists, so let's let them flip that. Uh, allied with Orat Ord and Zoo. Yep. Ye ye of course they are allied with both of them. 111. Yeah. Whew, god dang it. Alright, I'm going to put a cut right here, right now. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoy this episode. We went and left the time of troubles. But damn, that took a lot out of us. 300 golds and a lot of loans as you guys can see and most of them will have to be paid in November no way in hell we are going to be able to repay all of them I think but we will see stay tuned and see in the next episode well if you guys did enjoy this one please consider giving it a thumbs up it really helps out a lot and I'll see you guys in the next one so until then do take care and goodbye